Hey there, viewers! How to fall asleep in under 3 minutes every night Spending more time trying to fall asleep rather than actually sleeping? You're not alone. Just the act of trying too hard can cause or continue a cycle of anxious, nerve-wracking energy that keeps our minds awake. If your mind can sleep, it's really difficult for your body to follow. But there are scientific tricks you can try to flip the switch and guide your body into a safe shutdown mode. In this video, we will talk about the techniques you can do to fall asleep in under 3 minutes every bedtime. Continue watching this video to find out more. Number 1. Breathe with your mind Breathing patterns play a role in our autonomic nervous system, which regulates heart rate, muscle tension, motivation, and other aspects of relaxation or excitement. Whereas rapid shallow breaths can create a sense of anxiety, deep slow breaths can be calming. One technique to try is the 478 method. The process is fairly simple too. Here's how to do it. Place the tip of your tongue against the ridge behind your upper teeth throughout the exercise, inhaling and exhaling. Exhale completely via your mouth, making a whooshing sound. Now close your mouth and inhale through your nose to a count of four. Hold your breath for seven counts. Exhale slowly out of your mouth to a count of eight, making the whooshing sound. Pucker your lips if it feels awkward. Before we move on, a like would be awesome. Number 2. Caveman Setup At one point in time before the advent of smartphones, nights used to be dark and cold. And surprise, modern science finds that both cool temperatures and complete darkness are ideal for sleep. Artificial lighting and light from electronics can disrupt our biological clocks and tamper with our sleep quality. Keeping your bedroom free of artificial light and noise will not only ensure a nice dark sleep environment, but it also teaches your brain that your sleep cave is for sleep only, not for social media, world events, and other things that get our minds going. This trains your brain to automatically relax when you get into bed. So set up your bedroom like a prehistoric sleep cave. No television, laptops, tablets, or smartphones should be on when it's time to sleep. Use blackout shades or an eye mask if your room can achieve total darkness, or if your wake-up time is well past sunrise. Start dimming lights at least 30 minutes before you want to sleep to tell your body that it's bedtime. Even better, switch lamps to dimmer, warmer colored bulbs on computers to minimize light's impact. Number 3. Chill Out Ever notice how a cold office seems to leave you ready for nap time? Researchers have found that cooler temperatures do indeed appear to help us get deeper sleep and fall asleep faster. Plus, nothing feels as dreamy as wrapping up in a warm blanket in a cold room. Why does this work? Well, as our circadian rhythms approach the sleep phase, our body temperature naturally drops slightly and stays lower until a couple of hours before we normally wake up. In addition, insomniacs tend to have higher body temperatures overall. Those with sleep-onset insomnia, trouble falling asleep in the first place, tend to stay warmer later into the evening, which may play a role in their inability to fall asleep. The good news is that, by shifting their biological clocks earlier using bright light exposure in the morning, they may be able to get back into a normal body temperature rhythm and fall asleep faster. Just as some people prefer it warmer or cooler during the day, there is no one temperature fits all for ideal sleep, so be open to trial and error. If you want to go to a number to fall asleep fast in 5 minutes or less, try 65 degrees. It won't be the only necessary ingredients, but it'll be a good start. Another way to help this process is to soak in a warm bath for about 30 minutes before bedtime, further amplifying the temperature drop and potentially boosting deep sleep. You can also try sleeping in the buff since clothing can inhibit the natural process of evening out your body temperature as you rest. Number 4. Trick Your Brain do you know how sometimes when you try to do something, your stubborn brain backfires and does the opposite? Turns out the principle of paradoxical intention, similar to reverse psychology without deception, might be useful for sleep as well. The clinical use of paradoxical intention, that is purposely not trying to fall asleep while lying in bed, resulted in reduced sleep effort and anxiety for insomniacs compared to doing nothing. Also, high intention to fall asleep resulted in worse sleep quality. Instead of thinking about trying to go to sleep, tell yourself that you're trying to stay awake for a few minutes. If a dark, quiet bedroom makes your mind run, you can also try listening to an audiobook or a podcast on low volume, or visualize relaxing activities in your mind to take the focus off sleep itself. 
Number five, daydream with purpose. For many people who struggle with falling asleep, rumination or unwanted thoughts can play a big role. Instead of drifting off peacefully, your mind slogs through the day's events, embarrassing moments from years past or tomorrow's to-do list. One way to break the rumination cycle or disperse unwanted thoughts before bed is to practice visualization or imagery similar to daydreaming. There are a few ways to do this. Simply visualize a calming scene in your mind, imagining and exploring it in detail. It could be a serene beach, calm forest, or anywhere else. Alternatively, you might visualize yourself doing something positive but repetitive, such as shooting free throws. It may sound hippy-dippy, but if you focus on it effectively, daydreaming about relaxing scenes can really help ease your mind. During visualization, know that it's okay if your mind wanders. Simply return your focus to the scene gently and without judgment. Try out different methods and audio tracks to see what works best for you. Visualization can also be a helpful midday stress reliever to keep in mind. This also allows you to let go of future and past worries and live in the present, which can sometimes be exactly what people need to put their minds at ease and finally fall asleep fast. Number 6. Eat Carbs at Night Eating carbs 4 hours before bed can help you fall asleep faster and sleep better. Simple carbs which are quickly and easily digested. These include things like white rice, white bread and pasta, and potatoes as well as sugary foods. The key here is to keep dinner simple and moderate in portion so you won't be bothered with indigestion later. Eating carbs 4 hours before sleep is more effective than 1 hour prior, meaning planning your evening meals could prove helpful. Spicy foods can negatively affect your ability to fall asleep fast, so keep that in mind too. Number 7. Create a Consistent Sleeping Pattern Going to bed at different times every night is a common habit for many people. However, these irregular sleeping patterns could interfere with sleep because they interrupt the body's circadian rhythm. The circadian rhythm is a selection of behavioral, physical, and mental changes that follow a 24-hour cycle. A primary function of the circadian rhythm is to determine whether the body is ready for sleep or not. This is heavily influenced by a biological clock that releases hormones to induce sleep or wakefulness. Going to bed at the same time every night helps the body clock predict when to induce sleep. Number 8. Avoid Caffeine Caffeine is a stimulant. It stimulates wakefulness and can disrupt sleep patterns. Therefore, it is best to avoid caffeine for at least 4 hours before going to bed. In some people, consuming caffeine at any time of the day could have a negative impact on sleep quality. For these people, it may be best to avoid caffeine altogether. Number 9. Avoid alcohol before bedtime Drinking large amounts of alcohol before bed can have an adverse impact on sleep. Alcohol is problematic because it can induce feelings of restlessness and nausea, which can delay the onset of sleep. Number 10. Find a comfortable position A comfortable sleeping position is essential for sleep. Frequently changing positions can be distracting, but finding the right spot can make a big difference to the onset of sleep. Most people find that sleeping on their side is the best position for a good night's sleep. Have you tried any of these strategies? Let us know by commenting down below. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. For more interesting facts on the human body, subscribe to the channel. Here are two more videos you should check out, both of them will definitely help you reach your goals.